This is why I like to have the weekends. Oh, from the look of things, I just love it already. Uh, you know, like this. So, I think uh, you should be exhausted from the travels. Um, maybe I never imagined that you could actually make it here. Yeah, I was kind of scared. You know, meeting a guy for the first time. I understand, I understand. That's why I chose this place because I know that there is some sort of open air and Shall we have a drink, please? Oh, sure. If the way you do. Yeah, thank you. Welcome. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah, enjoy it. You act like a gentleman. Or is it because it's our first meeting? No, 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 no. These are. Um, I always act this way, not like a man of his own senses, and uh, you understand? <laughs> oh, that's wonderful of you. Can you tell me about you, please? No, you go first. No, 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 you know, it's always ladies first. Okay, what do you want to know about myself? Anything, you know, about your parents, maybe siblings, and maybe your dog. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, I'm the second one in the family of seven. My dad is a businessman. Oh. My mom is a primary school teacher. Well, like I told you earlier, I'm in Nairobi University pursuing Bachelor of Science in Education. For dogs, I have some hip dogs, maybe cats. Mm, what a wonderful background. Thanks. It's now your turn. Mm, where should I start? Okay. I'm the only son to Mr. and Mrs. Donaldson. My two younger sisters are in high school. My dad's a businessman, of course. Um, I studied at the Egerton University, uh, taking Bachelor of Science in Information Technology, and I'm also an actor. Oh wow, that's amazing. Come on, finish your juice. Oh, just know that when I've finished mine, I'm taking yours. No problem, I can just order more. Drink. Why do you have uh, that ring? Are you married? Um, how did you even notice that? Um, okay, it represents my level of success. Okay, this one, I um, actually got it when I started my first business enterprise. <laughs> you are crazy dude. I'm taking your name to the Guinness Book of Records. You better be sure of that. I was almost forgetting. Why do you have many fans? Oh, this one. Actually, my mom gave it to me as a gift during my 24th birthday. This one was given to me uh, by, um, by a friend during my graduation and this one I actually bought it with my own money. Wow, I guess she's a loving mother. Yeah, she was a loving mother. What? Did you just say was? I mean, she's no more? Yeah, I just celebrated her first anniversary last month. I'm so sorry. May she rest in peace. Thanks. Okay. Let's just get back to what brought us here. But I think uh, all these discussions is what brought us here. Or you've got an other mind. <laughs> what? Why are you giving me that look? Nothing. I'm um, just admiring you. What's on me that any other girl doesn't have? I'm just like a normal, ordinary girl out there. Ah, you are different. I've come across very many girls, but your beauty surpassed them. Actually, I think you've got all the qualities a woman should have. Mm, stop it! <laughs> it's not that I'm flattering you. But it's the truth. 
You are a replica of the angels from heaven. You are seriously making me shy. Am I really that beautiful? Let me assure you, Anita, you are that so beautiful. If I'm given the chance to describe you, I can feel all the books in this world. I mean, you are beautiful, you are lovely, charming, gorgeous. I mean, you can describe them, actually, you can name them. Well, wow, what can I say? I lack words. You know what? Anita, I think I'm in love with you. But uh, we haven't known each other for long. Um, come on. Let me show you something. I think this must be our special day. Let us, come on, let us finish up our drink and uh, at least have a walk around the town. I don't really think I will do that. Sure, they don't mind at all.